Hello everyone, welcome to my autumn vlog. Final conclusion on the pumpkin spice latte is speculating a long time waiting. I sat at home, I had nothing else to do. So I wrote this song for you. I hope it makes you feel like nothing ever changed the way that I am right now. Hold your hand like a demon. Hello everybody, so we're currently in the car and we're making our way to Starbucks. Get a pumpkin spice latte because I've never had one before and all my friends have tried it. I've seen it all over TikTok and Pinterest. So we go ahead and see what the fuss is about and see what the hype is all about. I might go to TK Maxx and also get a candle because it's candle burning season and I don't have any candles because I threw them all in the bin. I need to go pick up one up. I might get an old terminal one if they have one. If not, I'll just pick up a normal candle. But I'll see you when we get there. I'm finally back home and my final conclusion on the pumpkin spice latte is it's okay. It's not my favourite, if I'm being completely honest. Probably will give it like a five and a half like six out of ten like i get why people like it but i think this is like a tool so if i got anything more than this i would honestly would have felt a bit sick because it is really sweet and don't get me wrong like i love sweet things like, like i have a sweet tooth but like this is too sweet for me and yeah like i get why people like it and stuff but it's just not for me you know i probably wouldn't buy this again if i'm being honest so i did go into tk maxx and i bought two things it's like a massive bag but i only got two things first thing being a little body scrub so this is the sunday rain rejuvenating body scrub it's a natural sugar with acai berry extract i did open it up and smell it <laughs> but it smells really good and i've never had like a pure just body scrub before you just have like some exfoliating cream and there's like obviously the exfoliating like particles i don't know we've got like granules in there i tried like full like body scrub i've always wanted to so i've never heard anything about this brand before but i saw it and i was like this cute packaging and it smells nice what else can you ask for you know so i picked this up and i'm gonna use it in the shower later and see if it's good or not but i think it should be good like it's just a body scrub but we'll see last thing i got from tk maxx was the autumnal candle so this is by sand and fog and it's the vanilla pumpkin scent this was £8.99 it reminds me of halloween and like autumn because of like the orange and then the lid itself it has i don't know if you can see you probably can just see a black lid but there is like a little skull no it's not quite little it's like a kind of big skull embossed into the lid but there is a skull embossed in there i promise I like the scent of this there was another scent which i was debating on whether to get or not it was called pumpkin spice it was really really like strong and like overpowering for me but also this one you've got that vanilla scent which is like one of my favorite like scents like the little spice peeping through so i don't know i like this one more because it's more subtle and also it just smells delightful. I love this scent. I can't wait to go ahead and burn this. That's literally everything I got from TK Maxx. Next thing I'll do is actually do some college work because I have a sociology test coming up. It was like a little essay thing that I have to do, which I need to plan for. And then I also have to write up my business notes as well. So that's what I'm going to go ahead and do now. It actually smells quite nice. I'm gonna put this to the side now because I need to plan my sociology essay. To be fair, we did go through it in class and we did like highlight like the hooks and stuff. I just need to kind of basically plan what I'm gonna write in each paragraph. So it's a 30 marker, which for some reason, like I get sociology in terms of like the content and like the scholars and stuff, but like actually applying it to an essay, I find difficult. I don't know why. I don't know how well I'm gonna do on this 30 marker. She did say that we can use our plan because it's like our first like proper essay back from summer, which is good and very nice of her. Don't stop looking in my eyes. Are you cold? Do you want to see? I'm gonna do is actually go onto Pinterest and create a Pinterest board. Everything to do with autumn, so like like autumn baking, autumn outfit ideas, aesthetics basically. 
and hopefully it'll get me in like more of an autumnal mood. So let's go ahead and do that now. my pinterest board i am going to quickly go through it just to kind of give you an overview of what my pinterest board looks like i will link it down below in case any of you want to kind of add these pictures to your pinterest board obviously if i see something in a couple days time or a couple weeks time like the photo i will pin it so now this is kind of what it looks like it mainly got like pumpkins it's got like people going on like walks and stuff also got quite a lot of leaves like orange leaves brown leaves falling off the tree outfit ideas i've got loads of like baking ideas so like some cinnamon rolls which i think is just a classic in autumn time pumpkin shaped cookies also like toffee apples gilmore girls i've never watched the show but i see everybody watches it at autumn four time just like scenery pictures and then just like candles i said earlier on this video this like autumn and fall it's like a candle burning season so there's loads of candles out and about it's pretty much my autumn pinterest board for now like i said if i do like anything i will add on to it but that is kind of what it looks like for now i just finished having my shower and i did use the body scrub and it actually is quite good um i don't know what else i was expecting to us like it's just like a little sugar scrub but it actually worked really nice and my skin feels like really nice and smooth and like exfoliated obviously i only tried it once so I will see like how it goes for like a longer period of time and if I actually like it or not but like so far I do quite like it. Next thing I want to do is actually pick up a outfit for college tomorrow. So I was, I'm filming this, it's a Sunday and tomorrow's a Monday which means I have college which I'm not really excited for but to be fair it is my last week before I go on like half term so I mean kind of excited about that but I am going to go ahead and pick an outfit. It's supposed to be sunny tomorrow. But like the highest is like 17 degrees, so I mean it's not too sunny, it's still gonna be a little bit cold I think. Let's go to an art museum, I'll explain it at the coffee shop. I know you don't get it, but there's no need to fret it. I've chosen my top, now it's on to bottoms. Now I don't know if I want to go for like trousers or a skirt type of thing. picked my outfit for tomorrow i'm going with this pink long sleeve top um with a little collar i'm gonna go for this ralph lauren like cable net but like it is gonna be sunny i like i don't think it's gonna be like hot hot but like this is quite thick so i have opted for the pink top and for bottoms i just chose my cargoes because i think like they pair quite nicely they're quite breathable and they're just really comfortable to wear so pink top and the cargoes are my outfit for tomorrow so the last thing i want to do today is actually watch a movie and what else than watching harry potter like i absolutely love watching harry potter i went on the tv during like the run up for christmas um but i was like you know what i can't wait for that right now i want to watch harry potter now i'm going to go ahead and watch the prisoner of as caban It's like a gift, it's about the thought